This is our planet. Our planet is a game on top of the Wax blockchain. I have been aware of our planet for a little while, and now I am interested in using some of my NFTs that I have in my wallet to stake. It has been recommended to me, and I want to try it out for myself. So this video is going to be about staking your idle NFTs in order to earn Ether. So you're going to get a passive income in Ether, the, the token on our planet. Now, I think this is really nice, and I was a little hesitant to try this out just because I just like the idea of being able to buy NFTs, sell NFTs, and staking NFTs just didn't really, I didn't really appeal to me right away, but I've been hearing great things, and I would like to generate a passive income for myself. So I'm going to go ahead and try this out and see how it works. And I just want to mention that this is a great option for a lot of NFTs. Some NFTs are more popular than others. Some have a lot more demand. And what I've noticed is if you go to Atomic Hub and you try to sell all your NFTs, you know, if I wanted to sell all my NFTs, for instance, that I have in my wallet, I wouldn't be able to do it. You know, I've tried to make some NFTs um, available for very affordable prices, very low prices. And because the demand is not there at the current moment, you know, I'm stuck waiting. So this is something for a lot of those NFTs that you just have sitting idly in your wallet and you want to be able to get some sort of return, you can start mining Ether. So let's go ahead and let's go check this out and see how it goes. Since I joined Block Crafters, I've been completely in the WAX community and I've been collecting all sorts of NFTs. I know I have some tribal books. So let's go ahead and check that out, see what we can find. All right, cool. So pretty straightforward. I can see these are all my tribal book cards and it, these are the unstaked ones. So for the Maori book, I'm going to get 20 ether and 12 and four. So I'm guessing that's by the hour because I saw on the first page you can claim every hour. So I'm going to go ahead and try it out and just stake them and see what happens. I think this will be fun just to see how much you can actually earn just for having NFTs in your wallet because I've had these NFTs for a while and some of them I just don't want to sell. I'd rather just hold for the long term. I genuinely believe in the guys who are behind it and it doesn't make a lot of sense for me to sell some of these. I'd rather hold them long term. So this is a good option for me. All right, cool. So now I'm gonna click on staked and as you can see, they're all here. So if you want to unstake them, you can. Um, there's no lockup period, so that's a good thing. All right, cool. So in 34 minutes, this should be my next reward. So I'm gonna go ahead and stake a couple more, and we'll see we'll see how this goes. You know, I'll, I'll definitely track my progress just so you guys can see, just so that way you know, so you feel a little bit more comfortable and see how much you can actually make and if this is going to be a good system, you know. It's free money, you know, it's free money basically. If you're going to hold the NFTs, you might as well be staking them. And I have a lot of HODL God, so let's go ahead and check the HODL God NFTs out. Yeah, when HODL God first did their, their pack sale, I was all over it. I bought a whole bunch of them. And wow, each one of these is actually worth 20. Um, so that's cool. Looks like they're all worth 20. So I should be able to get a decent amount here. It looks like there is no stake all button. That would be nice. That's my only uh, critique or recommendation. It would be nice to have a stake all button because I have a feeling that's what most people are going to want to do. So it looks like you're going to have to go one by one and stake all your NFTs. So I'll go ahead and do that. We'll make you watch that part. All right, cool. So a full hour has elapsed. And as you can see, I had all my available NFTs staked in their staking system. So now I can check how many rewards I'm going to get. And it has it calculated for me in Ether, 2614.1. So I'm going to go ahead and claim that. And I should be able to claim that amount every hour. So that's pretty good. So once I claim, let's see, let's go ahead and refresh, claim, all right.
right, so this part actually kind of confused me a little bit because I thought the 2614.1 would pop up here under collected rewards after I hit the claim button, but I don't think that is the case. But it did go through because I'm looking up here and it says 2587, which isn't the full amount, the 2614.1, but I think that is because I missed um, a couple NFTs. So I think next hour it should give me the 2614.1, the full amount. So that's good. I'm mining the ether. And so I wanted to show you guys an exchange you can use. This is wax.alcor.exchange. If you want to trade um, TLM or void or ether in this case, you can see um, the price of ether right here, right? The last price, sell price, you guys know all that. But 2587 ether is what I have so I know the transaction went through. So I'm holding 2587 ether. And then let's just use this price here. So this is the price of ether in wax, right? Cause it's the wax trading pair. So I'm gonna just use the calculator real quick just so we can see every hour how much we're earning in wax. So 0 0.01, let's just say one, two, three. And then I'm gonna use this number 2614 so 0.1 all right so basically every hour i'm earning about 3.21 wax um because that's most likely what i'm going to do i'm going to sell the ether on this exchange and get wax because i'm trying to get more and more wax so i can keep collecting nfts so yeah so if you do that okay wax right now let's just say wax is around 25 cents right so let's say times 0.25 so that's about 80 cents an hour that's how much you're making so you know if you want to convert that in dollars so 80 cents an hour 24 hours in a day right making about 19 dollars a day which hey that's something right and then that doesn't count the appreciation maybe ether price goes up maybe wax price goes up, whatever the case may be. Not to mention that you can use the ether to craft and mine inside the game, which actually I might start doing because this kind of makes me want to play the game because I want to see how I can compound this, how I can make more. So that's probably what I'll end up doing. Not 100% sure yet. I might check it out and, and see if I can compound that way. But like I said, $19, that's something. And you, you play that out over seven days. You know, that's $135 extra every single week, you know, and then every month, say four weeks, you got an extra $540, you know, and that's assuming everything stays stable. But, you know, I think that's pretty cool uh, considering I wasn't earning that before. Now I am. So I like that. That's pretty cool. So, yeah, I think uh, I think that's how I'm going to flow for now. If uh, this looks interesting to you. Go ahead and, and do it because it's real simple. You know, just go to ourplanet.io staking and just start claiming your rewards and just, you know, have them compound, you know, because that's what you can do. You can, if you want to keep, if, if you're liking this system, you're having a lot of success with it, keep using the ether, you know, mine in the game, buy wax, buy more NFTs, wash, rinse, repeat, you know, build this into a little bit of a passive income. So I'm looking to have at least, I would say, by the end of summer, I want to have five solid passive income streams in crypto. So this is a good one. So definitely, I hope this helped you guys out. You know, check it out. Really easy to do. And, you know, I'm going to keep going through it. So let me know if you have any questions in the description box below. I'll try to, my best to answer the question. As far as resources, you're going to make, you need to make sure you have resources because it will eat up your CPU really quick. So I had to add some resources. So that's it.